Hi everyone, this is Shiva Teja from Einstein Analytics product team. Today let us check a few options around compare table. So I'm just clicking on my opportunities data set and have moved into the new lens mode. We all know that we can select a few measures over here and group them by specific dimensions. Let us see what compare table has to offer. Compare table can be accessed by clicking on the middle button, there is a table mode, and selecting the compare table option. We can see the tabular version of the data that we have selected earlier. So let us first see of one of the key features of the compare table. You can add a sum of amount again, and in compare table, you are allowed to add measure specific filters. Let's see what I'm talking about. For the first measure, I'm adding a closed filter that is open. And for the second measure, I'm adding a filter on the same field. And this time I'm choosing closed. So by selecting just filters over here, I'm able to show closed amount versus open amount for each industry. You can also add a filter on the created date that is relative to now and quarter and this quarter for example. So for opportunities created this quarter per industry I have closed versus open amount. Let us also see a few options around editing each of these columns. So when you click on the drop down, you can also see the option of edit this column. So I can add the headers. I can move to the next column and add a header here as well. Please note that when you have moved towards the end, you can see a plus sign through which you can add a new column. The reason you would want to add a new column is to create any calculated or formula specific fields. So let us just see an option of rank based on the open amount. So if you click on the function button over here you will be able to see different options of sliding window, percentage of group, rank within group, running total or change from previous. Let me just select. Period over period is uh, grayed out because the group that I've selected is not a date specific group. If the selection is date, the period over period would be available as well. Let me just select rank within group. So I want to have my rank based on the open amount column and the order should be descending since I want lower rank for higher amount. My, f You have different options of rank, dense rank, cumulative distribution or row number. I am just selecting rank here. The reset group here is none. However, if you have multiple groupings, you can set the reset groups as well. You can sell if you have three or more groupings, you can also select multiple reset groups. And in format, this is a simple number format. When I click on apply, you can see that my highest value is given the rank 1 and subsequently rank 2 and 3 and so on. If you wish to have this value or have some operations on this value, for example, you want to sort ascending or descending. You can also sort them and you can further hide these columns. So the sorting has happened based on this column and the column is now not available to be viewed. It is hidden. You can further move back into a chart mode and select a different chart. So once operations are made incompatible, you can always switch back to the chart mode for different visualizations. 
So these are a few options around compare table. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.